Pelosi folds, confirms House will reluctantly pass Trump's emergency border bill. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, D. California, announced that the Democratic-controlled House will bend the knee, and has agreed to pass the Senate's $4.6 billion immigration bill to deliver aid to the southern border. In a Thursday letter, Pelosi said that while the House is gravely disappointed in the Senate for passing their own immigration legislation, the children come first. Therefore, we will not engage in the same disrespectful behavior that the Senate did in ignoring our priorities. In order to get resources to the children fastest, we will reluctantly pass the Senate bill, the letter continues. According to Bloomberg, the turnaround came after moderate Democrats flexed their power within the caucus by joining with House Republicans to urge Pelosi to simply vote on the bipartisan Senate bill before lawmakers leave Washington for next week's recess. Pelosi and Vice President Mike Pence spoke on Thursday after which he said he agreed that the Trump administration would make changes to how migrant shelters are run, according to Texas Democrat Henry Kula. I would hope we've all had our say we all feel strongly about our points, said Rep. Tom Cole, are OK, the top Republican on the Rules Committee, in a House floor speech Thursday afternoon. But let's agree on the one thing we know can pass and the President would sign. Both the House and Senate bills contain more than $1 billion to shelter and feed migrants detained by the Department of Homeland Security and nearly $3 billion to establish care for unaccompanied migrant children turned over to the Department of Health and Human Services. Both bills also ensured that funding could not be allocated to Trump's border wall. Progressive Democrats, meanwhile, are not happy as they were pushing for significant changes to the Senate bill that would eliminate $145 million in Defense Department funding for border security. We should not be funneling more money to a rogue agency, said Progressive Caucus leader Rep. Bram Legiopoul, adding to be clear, I will not support the Senate bill. Let's see how Pelosi's party treats her now that she's closed the door to impeaching Trump and given Senate GOP a win.